Hello from Uganda. Can you believe it has been a year since we started this solution center with the support of schools building schools? It has been an amazing year. Let's share with you what happened in the last four months. Hi, I'm Brenda. Good morning, Brenda. I'm grateful to be a blogger. Yeah. And my work is there. Yeah, I can see you. <laughs> Our team has really grown. Join me as I introduce to you the vloggers and other team members. So, here we are. Yes. <laughs> Hello, I'm Nessari Sophie and I'm proud to be a youth vlogger at Sao. Yes. Hello, Angel. Hi there. I'm Angel and it's always exciting to be the girl on the camera. Yes. Lily. Hello, I'm Lydia. Today you can see um, I've just finished editing my third vlog. I'm so excited to share it for review so you can join in. So that is the team of the vloggers including me myself and I'll be introducing to you another team on the other side. My name is Teddy Namazi and I work as the office administrator at Sao World. Um, my name is Iklai Winfred and I work with Sawal as a project director um, Dreams and the project is called Packed Women. My name is Sharifa Nanzi and I'm the monitoring and evaluation coordinator for the Packed Women Dreams project. Uh, my name is Arthur Magom and I'm working as an accountant coordinator here at Sawal. I am working on uh, these three projects of dreams and also some part of uh, Sao World Association. We also had a vibrant intern from Inside Global Education from Canada join the Sao family in the last four months. During this period, Luji got to grow her skills in taking photos, filming different activities at the Solution Center, but also filmed and produced one successful story of a replicator called Shamila. Uh, after Sour Day, like one month passed by, and we have a group of women doing savings. Uh, the first group has 30 members, so I bought them a chemical. After saving, I taught them how to mix the liquid soap and told them also not to stop there. They can even go and teach more women. So I think a liquid soap, wow, it has changed to me. Very early in the morning, I sold my 20,000 shillings. Now I'm going to pack more. So when I pack, and I know out of what I've packed, I can, because here I still have much, I can, I, I can estimate it to, estimating it to 25 bottles, what is here. That is 25,000. So when I put it plus that one, I'll be able to save. That is 45,000. I'll be able to save and also to buy food for my children. We've had a number of trainings with the vulnerable girls in four districts of Mitiana, Mukono, and uh, Gomba and um, they are appreciating the different solutions Sour so World and the other partners are bringing to them. So being in the workshops and seeing these girls learn the solutions and we already have a couple of people who have called and notified that they've started. This project has reached out to 1,846 girls in the last three months alone and more are going to be trained in the course of this year and half of next year. In other developments, we have also continued to conduct different workshops around the solution center. Among these, we taught people how to rear chicken, how to do chicken rearing, how to do candle making, how to do African earrings, sandals, and ecofuel stoves. Mm -hmm. Ye business yota kura rosi no mo no 
Nabi no nobu soka kubisa no labi. Nimbi wana wansi. Bio nabi jam sifa sifa yo babiri mutaka babiri muchi. Nyola kasasi reona korechi. Nteka mu. Nere tu bare tu kola candles. No Mosomoguli, Omsomosofagua, Kutano, Banga Nasoka, the Danes, Janin, so cook some fuel saving stoves. Then Nemala, Nebatsomesa, urban farming, Nadiwo. Then, apart from urban farming, Nakola, ne how to make African sandals. We really wanted to know the impact that we have created in people's lives as a result of accessing the solution center. In last year, December, we conducted a phone survey and we found out that 60% of the people replicated the different local skills that we taught them and their lives were changed. With the impact we've created this year, we hope it really makes you proud and we thank you for supporting us. From Team Uganda, we 